So today we're talking about build on the rock. Now, what does that mean? We well, you know this guy, Jesus, and one of the stories that he told was about two guys. One built his house on sand and the other guy built his house on the rock. Now, when a storm came, a really, really big storm, which one do you think stood tall? That's right, the one built on the rock. The one built on the sand, it crumbled. It crumbled under the big storm. Now, hold that thought. I'm gonna tell you a story about my family. So, my parents bought this house. Yep, that's my house. And they loved it so much because of the tree that was in the front yard. It was this beautiful, huge oak tree. I mean, it stretched to like beyond the power lines. Like it was huge. I could not wrap my arms around it. Like it was the biggest, most beautiful tree. It even was featured in a KPTV from a few years ago, which is funny. It's a beautiful tree and we loved it so much. Well, last year we got a really big storm. And by big, I mean huge. It was a scary, scary storm. At 5 a.m., I heard something and it was like a boom. It scared me so bad and so I ran to my door and I looked out the window in the dark and you know what it was? It was our tree. This huge oak tree that stood so tall had fallen to the ground. You know why it fell? The thing that it was built on, the thing holding it up, its roots, they weren't good. They were rotten. They were weak. They were soft. When a storm came and the ground got wet, those roots didn't hold. It did not hold that tree up. And by one storm, that whole tree fell. Jesus talked about we should build our lives on the rock. What is that? It's the word of God. It's Jesus himself. It's God. The way that he helps us to live, it's the things that he says to us that we build our lives on the rock. It's that we listen to his word. When we're afraid, we don't hold on to things that are weak because that won't hold us up. It's not gonna help and we're just gonna fall. But if we, when we get scared, we hold on to the rock, which is the word of God, you'll remember to say, God has not given me a spirit of fear, but of power, love, and a sound mind. When you get afraid, when you feel like you don't belong, you'll remember that he says you are chosen. You are chosen for a good purpose and that He loves you. You always hold on to His Word because when you hold on to anything else, it's gonna be like that tree. It doesn't matter how cool you are. It doesn't matter how big you are, how strong you think you are. If you're not holding on to God, if God's not your foundation, you're gonna end up like our sad little big oak tree. But if you hold on to God's Word, if you build your life on the rock, guess what? You will stand so tall.